<laughs> okay. filming yet? Yeah. So we are here and we are doing some stuff to get ready for winter since it's going to freeze. And one thing that we need to do is drain our water tanks. These are our um, these two 275 gallon water totes that we have for in series that we've done videos on before to that we use to irrigate our nursery. But in the winter time, I don't know if we could winterize these or not, but we if we can, great, but we haven't figured it out yet. So, so we instead drain them into our little creek, which is not a perennial creek, but it runs probably, I don't know, at least six months of the year. But so we're, rather than just dump it on the surface of the ground, we run it into our little creek. So while that's happening, we are also taking apart the simple components of our water system, which is just a, a little water pump, 12 volt water pump, pump that we run with a small 12 volt battery that we charge with some solar panels and then just a couple of hoses and stuff. So what are we doing with those? We just put them in our little barn and so we just store them for the winter and pretty simple. This has one, been one of the simplest little systems we've come up with that actually works well and we would highly recommend and um, and if it ain't broke, don't fix it. So this one works good. So we haven't really changed it much. We could definitely make it more complicated, but it wouldn't make it more effective. So so since it works so great, everybody, and we did that video on it, I'll put a link to it at the end. And if you have a way that you winterize your rainwater catchment system, let us know in the comments. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you.